Hello and assalamu alaikum. Welcome back to Shannara Vlogs. I hope you're all well and enjoying the lovely weather we've had these few days. Not so good today. Please do ignore the rubbish in my garden because I live on the main road and all of the rubbish just tends to fly in and the leaves and everything. If you ask the delivery man, he will take your shopping straight into your kitchen. But I always just collect it from the doorstep. I'm quite happy to do it myself. And if you want, they'll leave the crates with you and you can do it all in your own time and give the crates back the next time they come with the next delivery. My husband had actually ended up tidying away some of the shopping before I got a chance to record it. I didn't realise till like a couple of hours after recording. I've laid out all the shopping so that I can share it with you. And it's just all on here on the floor. I thought it'd be easier than having it on the countertops. So just starting off with the Bombay mix, these were on offer. They're usually a pound, uh, Asda's and Tesco's, but they're on offer at 70p. If you buy them from other places, they're about £1.10, £1.20. They're just nice to keep in, you know, if, if guests come round, it's just nice to put, say, in one of these bowls, maybe. Um, I got two of these bowls. I already have some. I'm just adding them to my collection. They were on offer. They were 80p each. The quality is really good. I've got other pieces in the same range. This is some celery, as you can see. We go through a lot of celery, but I just ordered one from here. We'll be doing another the shop from Lidl or maybe Aldi's. Get some more from there. And I've got two boxes of eggs here. Something that we go through a lot of is because of the protein content. So, and it's easy and versatile. Got some fish fingers here. I ordered the battered ones, but they sent me a substitute. They sent me the breaded ones. I didn't realize until I actually started recording. They're not as popular in my household. It's okay, we'll make do with those. They did, of course, send me an email with a list of all the substitutes. I always forget to check those emails. And yeah, I didn't check when he dropped it off either. So that's completely my fault. They're very good. If you don't like anything or you don't want anything on the order, you can just hand it back to the driver. Got some cheese here. Go through about a block of cheese a week on average, not all weeks and next to that was some cheese singles and i bought this big bottle of olive pomace oil it's not that big i think it's about three liters it was on offer from i think it was eight pound to five pound something like that but i paid five pound for it anyway and i got this bottle of orange and pineapple cordial i like to keep some of that in the house all the time and we've got some tango here and some orange and pineapple fruit crush. Uh, no, actually, it's um, it's a trop tropical fruit crush. Getting tongue twisted there. Um, I've not got too many this time. I'm trying to cut down on fizzy drinks as much as possible. I don't drink it, but the kids do. And i got a bag of these easy peelers. We go through quite a lot of them. I like to take them to work as well. So we'll go through like a couple of bags. But like I say, we'll be getting more when we get our next shop from maybe Little or Aldi. Got some parsley here in a packet. We use the parsley with this romaine lettuce and celery. And you can put a bit of ginger in it if you want and make some juice with it. First thing in the morning on an empty stomach it's really good for you so we do go through a lot of this but like I said I just got one of everything on this order I've, we've got some lemons there got a couple of cucumbers we go through a lot of cucumbers as well but then there's sometimes I'll buy cucumbers and they'll go off they'll not get used got these uh, plain flour got two bags and they're only 40 I think they're about 45p each but it's very good quality it's a big bag and I ordered two packs of paratas. I don't like this Rhea brand. The paratas are a lot smaller and they're kind of dry. I prefer the Hamza brand, which is exactly what I did order. But they sent me these as a substitute. Got an almond milk there. 
and we go through a few of those but we've already got some at home and i've got three of the ginger and garlic cubes and i've got some canned chickpeas and tomatoes i've got more of these but i'm stocking up for ramadan and i've just got like a tin of carnation to make some yogurt with this one's the evaporated milk i've also got a condensed milk and a greek yogurt which i've I think that's already been tidied away in the fridge. I got these two bags of rice. I think they were seven fifty each, but they're on offer at five fifty each. They've got a few different types of rice on offer. I just chose these two. Next to it, got a bread. I always try and get the fifty fifty king's mill. So yeah, that's that. And then I've got this pure butter ghee. I do make my own with butter, but um, every now and again I'll buy a proper uh, ready-made ghee, if you will. Uh, got some dates for Ramadan. These were also on offer, I think about £2 or two forty-five, something like that. And got some ibuprofen to go in my medicine cabinet. It's just good to have handy, you never know when you need it. And I got these toothpaste. These were on offer. They're supposed to be £5 each, but they're half price at the moment at two fifty pounds each. So I've got two different ones, the Enamel Care and the Deep Clean, and also the Oral-B Glamorous White. We use that one quite regularly. I don't know how good it is, but yeah, we do tend to use that one quite regular. Um, got some custard. I got two of those. I keep them handy because you just never know when you need some custard. It's not something we have that often, but they do have a long shelf life. So when we use up the custard, we always buy some more. So there's always some in the cupboard. Um, and then I got these Apollos. These are sugar free. Never tried the sugar free before. So um, that'll be interesting. And we got this Glade uh, air freshener again never tried this one before uh, this scent got some tandoori spice blend first time getting this as well i prefer the Rhea brand they didn't have any of that so we'll see how we got on with that got a box of tissues uh, some bananas and these are so good i've never seen them in these smaller packs They're usually in the bigger packs and um, i saw these in a multi-pack so i had to pick that up that I think I'm sure that was on sale as well on offer not sale sorry it was on offer for I think a pound and I'd ordered um, I didn't order these ones I ordered the uh, different ones and they've sent these poppadom curls so these are a substitute my fault for not checking the list and some bottles of water for pack lunches and yeah this desiccated coconut that's because it eats around the corner and i can just make something with the coconut always comes in handy around eat time got some of these um cheetos cheese puffs there are some really good offers on at the moment in asda's and i believe tesco's as well because of ramadan like especially things like your dates and oil and rice and flour um, basically most of the Asian things the uh, ginger and garlic cubes that I got they were on offer as well they were on at 85p the Pratas that I'd ordered were the Hamza ones at 350 on offer at £3 but of course they sent me the Rhea ones instead but that's fine the chickpeas were on offer at 5 for 150 the tomato tins 5 for 150 as well they do send an email before they come out with the delivery so you can have a look at any sort of substitutes or anything that's not available but i always forget to check the emails and then when they come with the delivery i do tend to forget to check to see if there is any substitutes so that's everything in my asda haul apart from the things that were already tidied away and take care everyone allah hafiz assalamu alaikum